Now to two of the most notable steps in the road to reopening. Starting May 17th, two weeks from today, the MTA will resume 24-hour subway service. And then two days after that, all capacity limits are lifted for businesses in New York, New Jersey, and Connecticut. CBS 2's Allie Bauman joins us live on the Upper West Side with more. Allie. Dick and Christine, the three governors say because our vaccination rates are increasing and our hospitalizations are decreasing, this summer may actually feel somewhat normal. Even the subway will finally resume full service. But keeping all these places clean and safe is not so simple. On May 19th, capacity restrictions will be lifted in the tri-state area for retail, restaurants, offices, gyms, amusement parks, hair salons, museums, and theaters, including Broadway. We were very, very excited because it's about time just to get back in our feet. There are caveats. Businesses will still be required to guarantee that unvaccinated people can keep six feet apart. We have not been able to increase inside because of the six feet social distancing rules. The announcement comes on the same day 80,000 city workers return to their in-person jobs after more than a year of working from home. Many had spent days rallying, wanting to push the start date back to September. Others just trying to ease into the process again. I woke up pretty early um, just to put makeup on for the first time in a year and a half. 24-7 subway service in New York City will resume May 17th after being reduced last year for added cleaning. It affects me when I'm working late and I have nowhere to get home other than taking three buses. The MTA says they will continue cleaning every day but cannot promise enough space for social distancing so masks remain a requirement. As for any riders who feel unsafe, the governor had this to say. Have you been on the subway? Because I have and I was scared. Yeah, I'm not telling my child to ride the subway. We can't turn the subway system back into a mobile running homeless system. The MTA has been asking the city for more police and outreach support, but Mayor de Blasio insists it's under control. It really comes down to a lot of outreach at the right places at the right times, and we'll certainly be ready for that. I've pushed all of the MTA police into the subway system. You know, I've ordered thousands of cameras. I've hired security contractors who are in uniform. I'm doing everything I can to make sure that my riders and my workforce is safe. What I really need is for the city to meet me halfway. As for that six-foot rule for unvaccinated people, both Governors Cuomo and Murphy say if the CDC changes its guidance, so too will New York and New Jersey. We're live on the Upper West Side. Allie Bauman, CBS2 News. All right, Allie, thanks very much.